this is problem 9.5 and we like to find the centroid of this plate that it has a cubic form. So we have to recall the definition of centroid and the centroid will be equals to the centroid of my differential of area divided by the total area and y will be my centroid of the area divided by the total area. So let's first determine the area. Know that the, the, the area will be the integral of the differential of area. So we have to choose either to integrate a differential of area or we can do it as a linear integral by choosing a vertical strip. This vertical strip will be y and this will be the x and the x will be located at x so we can write my differential of area instead of doing a double integral we can do a one dimension integral by doing the differential of area will be y dx so we have y the x and my limits of integration will be from the variable that I chose to integrate, which is the x, and that will be from 0 to 1 meter. And then I have to put y in terms of my variable integration, therefore this is the integral from 0 to 1 of x cubed the x, and that will be equals to x to the 4 over 4 evaluated in 0 and 1 meters. Therefore, my area is 1 and the, the, the 1 fourth, right, will be my, my units for area is meters square. Okay, so once we have found the area, we can do the integral in the numerator. So let's do the centroid for x. Here we have the centroid of my differential of area. All the area is located at my variable x. Therefore, it will be x. And the differential of area, we already say that is y dx. And the limits of integrations are for x from 0 to 1 meter. And I have to put y in terms of x. And that, of course, divided by my total area, which is 1 fourth. And then this is equals to 0 to 1 meter x, and y is equals to x cubed dx divided by 1 over 4, which is the same as writing 4. So 4, and the integral of x to the 4th will be equals to x to the 5 divided by 5. And then the limits will be 1, 0 to 1. Therefore, when we evaluate, we get, this is 4 fifth meters. Now to do y, we got that the centroid of my differential of area, as you see, is located in the half of the total height because it's a rectangle, right? So in this case, I have to write here y half, which is the centroid of my differential of area, d the area over the total area. And then I can convert that double integral in y over half. My differential of area is y dx over the total area, which is one fourth. And my limit is of integration will be from 0 to 1 meters. And that is equals to 4, I will pass that to, to the top, 0 to 1. And that gives me over 2, right? I have these two, I can take it out of the integral, y square dx. And y square will be x to the 6. So that will be equals then to 2 integral of 0 to 1 x to the 6 dx. Therefore, this is 2x 7 over 7 
evaluated between zero and one meters. So finally, I got that my y will be two over seven meters. And that's the centroid of my figure. So the centroid means that for this plate, x and y, the centroid is located at somewhere over here, which this is 4 fifth, and this is 2 seventh. Well, 4 fifth is almost 1. Let me put it more to 4 fifth. Okay, meters. And this is the solution of this problem.